I was at home, it was a Sunday. All of a sudden I had the pain that was incredible. It felt literally like a bear was clawing at my back. Next thing I know, I was on my knees, I was on the floor. Marion first came in with, with back pain uh, and a diagnosis was made of an aortic dissection. And a dissection uh, is very dangerous. Uh, it can lead to rupture of the aorta. The Cardiovascular Institute here at Beth Israel Deaconess Medical Center represents the collaborative efforts that we've had for many years now between vascular surgery, cardiac surgery, and cardiology. The formation of a multidisciplinary team is important in many ways. Uh, they get to have three minds in one uh, to review the images, review the data, review the history. It's not always clear from the beginning of what these patients should receive. Should they emergently go to surgery or should they be watched and monitored closely with good blood pressure and heart rate control? So it's important that we all sit down frequently and talk. And I think what's unique about here is our ability to do that. The fear of, of maybe dying from this wasn't as strong as the fear of not being able to know what the next minute for minute would bring. The staff I dealt with in the emergency room, they alleviated that fear. We noted that she'd had fairly rapid expansion of her aorta, so we recommended uh, a surgical procedure. There are certain procedures that require the expertise of a cardiac surgeon and a vascular surgeon simultaneously in the operating room to tackle different portions of the aorta. We're lucky that the hospital is actually very supportive uh, of the development of new technologies we have the full breadth uh, at our fingertips uh, every day of all the, the most modern advances that really allow us to provide the best care for our patients. And as the technology continues to advance, we continue to push that further and further so that more and more patients who previously weren't candidates for a minimally invasive procedure now are. The doctor is the leader of the team. It's my health. I'm making decisions with him. The staff is there to support. They do an excellent job keeping me together, keeping me positive, and I think I'm doing pretty well now.